With Dream Report 4.8, we're going big. To meet the needs of larger customers, remote workforces, and SIs supporting multiple installations, Dream Report 4.8 introduces a true multi developer concurrent development environment. We've added connectivity to a cloud based historian, Wonderware Online Insight, for big data access. And now we're including web portal access in every Dream Report license. And as always, We've added many useful enhancements to the leading industrial reporting and dashboarding solution, including enhanced productivity tools, like a new common alarm filter management interface for all alarm data sources, and extended search and replace functionality, enhanced communication driver functionality and performance, and some new graphical options. So let's take a look at the major architectural change to Dream Report 4.8. With this release, the entire project configuration is now contained in a single configuration database, as opposed to a set of multiple configuration files and folders. The immediate benefits of this change are that it's simpler to manage, backup, and secure your projects. But an even bigger benefit is that with a configuration database or project repository, it facilitates a true multi-developer environment. For local and remote users, who can work on a reporting project concurrently or independently without overriding each other's work. Project integrity is maintained, with the ability to lock report modules such as communication drivers configuration, SPC definitions, user managements, etc., as well as individual reports. Even if multi-user or concurrent development is not being performed, the project repository allows for an audit trail and version control at both the project or the report level. This is a must-have for several regulated industries. And for customers using both the development system and a separate production system, the new project deployment option allows you to develop and fully test the reporting project independently of the production system, and then deploy the project to the production or runtime system when ready. Any legacy Dream Report projects will be automatically converted after prompting the user to the new configuration database. It's up to you then, whether you want to develop your project in the traditional way or use the project repository, which we'll cover next. For remote or concurrent project development, you start off by creating a new project, convert a legacy project, or open an existing project, as you've always done in Dream Report Studio. Then, simply click on the option to enable concurrent development and specify the secure connection parameters that remote users will need to supply when initially connecting. The project repository file will then be created for use with the concurrent or remote development. On the remote development nodes, a user starts Dream Report Studio, and if the first time connecting to a remote project repository, enters the secure connection settings required by the repository node. The user selects the repository file on that server, multiple projects might be available to work on, or simply select the current running project. And then, finally, specify the path for the local working copy of the project. At this point, remote developers can lock one or more project modules and or reports to work on to prevent any other users editing those same reports, and then unlock them when done or leave locked if necessary. Note here that a red dot on the report indicates that the report is locked by another user, and the report appears grayed out for editing. Once the user is ready to commit their changes to the main project repository, they can do so at the individual module or report level or all at once. A comment will be required when committing, which will be associated with the version control. The enhanced version control enforces and ensures compliance, adherence to validation requirements, and project integrity. At the project level, you can review comments by user for each modification or version and roll back to that version if needed. Or, at the report level, review comments associated with individual reports and roll back to a specific version of that report if needed. Of course, this functionality is significant in many of the industries we serve. With our new driver for Wonderware's cloud-based online historian, Dream Report becomes the online historian reporting engine to augment the Wonderware Insight web-based analytic tools. Dream Report already includes a driver supporting the OData protocol for online historian-based alarms. The new driver exposes both raw and aggregated or summary data from the online historian. The additional benefits of using Dream Report as the reporting engine for online historians is that you can connect to multiple online historians simultaneously and combine data across historians in a single report, 
and even combine data from an online historian with non-online historian data sources like alarm logs, SQL databases, batching systems, and the like. This really allows you to harness the power of a cloud-based historian, along with on-premise data sources, to contextualize your data and drive your operational performance and compliance requirements. The new Alarms and Events Filter Manager provides a common alarm and event filtering interface for all alarm data sources. Common filtering by alarm priority is specified in this interface. And then, any alarm filtering parameters, such as alarm group, name, type, acknowledgement state, etc., configured in a specific communication driver, can be included in this interface. This alarm filter manager can then be accessed from any object that supports alarm reporting, simplifies alarm management and reporting in larger applications, and helps in performing alarm analysis to deliver on ISA 18.2 requirements, such as analysis of alarms, worst offenders, groups by assets, individuals, etc. With the new search and replace interface, whether you're editing an existing report or applying a report template to a new report or a new project, the new interface allows you to quickly replace data sources, item names, time period definitions for your report objects, and SQL or advanced filtering conditions on your objects. The new graphical interface includes many options and search criteria. It highlights the objects on a report that contain matches to the search criteria, and then allows you to pick from a list of individual or all items to replace. The obvious benefits here are that it further simplifies applying report templates to reports or other projects. SIs can benefit in that it allows them to easily port projects or reports from one automation platform to another, and end users can apply existing reports to new lines, processes, equipment, etc. with quick tag substitutions. As always, we're developing new or enhancing existing communication drivers. With the existing Wonderware Historian driver, we've included a filtering option based on a specific data quality. A customer requirement has been to ignore a value at the start of a query period if needed, and this option is now exposed. We've enhanced the GE Smart Signal Predictive Analytics driver with new functionality, and with the existing GE Historian driver, the connectivity has been optimized to deliver up to a 10 times performance improvement in certain scenarios. And finally, the Yokogawa Historical Values driver has been updated to support Yokogawa's newer MX file format. The last thing to talk about is the new licensing options in 4.8. Every Dream Report license now includes at least one concurrent web client for the Dream Report web portal. So, even if you're not sure if you want or need to use the web portal, you can try before you buy and always add additional web clients later on. Here's the breakdown of included web clients by each base tag license. As always, your Dream Report license includes full development capabilities. The difference now in 4.8 is that it's a development seat that can be used locally on the main Dream Report node or from a remote development station by a single user at a time. And it can be accessed from different development stations as well. If you want additional concurrent development capabilities, you can buy additional concurrent development licenses which add to the one already included. We encourage you to download Dream Report 4.8 and explore these new capabilities. Just remember, 4.8 does require a new license, so first make sure to contact your Dream Report distributor to either upgrade your existing license to 4.8 or purchase a new license. Thank you.